Welcome back to <laughs> We have some really fun things that we're going to be testing today to yes. see what is worth it and what is not. One came from the comment section from our last video, and you guys were asking us to find a dupe of the Dyson blow dryer, and we have found it, and we are going to test it out today. It's perfect. <gasps> yes. My so we're going to be doing Hannah's hair. It's half wet. Half dry. <laughs> okay, so this is the Dyson, the Dyson Airwrap, and this is um, six six hundred depend six hundred or seven hundred depending on like the accessories. When I got it, it was like nine hundred dollars. It was expensive, so yes. it has come down a little bit in price. But... Here is the main part of the blow dryer, and then it comes with like a bunch of things, so like hair kinds of things, and. Just and then these are the hair wrap part. Are the wrap part to curl it. So, yeah. I love this. I've been using it for a long time. Um, however, I use it as a blow dryer. I don't love these. Just my personal opinion. My hair doesn't hold the curl all day if I use these. I've tried it several times, but by the end of the day, my hair is like flat. But I just don't love how it curls. I think it depends on your hair. Like yeah. tech. Also, it depends on what products you're using because I do notice that products do help your hair last. Yes, I do love this one um, because it kind of like straightens and shines mm -hmm. your hair. So I use this at the end of it, and I do love this part. I this love this nice. part. This is my favorite part of the. Book. That is what the Dyson hair dryer looks like, and all the accessories. Here is the dupe we found. So this is seventy-five dollars on Amazon, and they actually had a coupon when I ordered it, so I got it for sixty-eight dollars but it comes in a box like this. So not quite as cute of a box, but a lot better price. So it does come with the same like little curler things, a little straightening brush, and then this. And then it has an extra one that that one didn't come with. Which is like a blow drying brush. Yeah, it's double sided. And then it has your normal this one too. So very similar accessories. So let's see the difference. The quality on this one does feel like cheaper, but I don't know. Well, so Hannah was telling me that there is a hack that you can do, like certain hair products yeah. and doing it a certain cool versus hot. But yeah, to, like, you have to like let it curl. cool. You have to like hot, you have to shock it. So you have to do like hot and then turn it on cold in the middle. So then it shocks it. So then it will it. I've tried doing that, but my hair just doesn't hold a curl. Yeah. Weight wise, this is like light really light <laughs> compared to this, so it's yeah. It's, what do I do? I'm gonna blow it. Blow dry at the same time. Blow it at the same time. Okay. Wait, we're gonna try half. It didn't blow. <laughs> it didn't start. I think I have to. Okay, this one's hotter. Oh, that one's definitely hotter. Okay, so this one's hotter. This yes. one's... Oh, but they're different. Which one, which one blows hard? Do it again. Like, I'll put them both okay. on high speed and tell me which one blows okay. higher. <laughs> Stronger. Okay, she said this they one, feel almost the this same. This one's just a little bit more. Just a little bit more power. More power? Yeah. Okay. So now let's put our first accessory on. <laughs> it's snapped in there really nice. Now with the accessory on, same accessory. Alright. This one very much is not pushing air very much through. I think it might I want to push. Like, and then. Oh yeah, this yeah. one's way more powerful than that this is, one. Yeah. Air pushing wise. This brush is really interesting, so it's kind of like, I don't know. It's like a blow drying brush, but then it's flat. It's not, it doesn't have that like round. Yeah. You know what I mean, that normal. Okay. Should we try the air wrap part now? Yeah. So let's try to get the same size. So the Dyson one does come with two different Maybe, sizes. I think I just tried to put this on. Does it work? <laughs> it does not fit. You cannot interchange. 
I accidentally tried to do that. Wait. I'm gonna do this one. Hello. Okay. We're so we're gonna dry half of our hair with this a little more before we curl it. Okay, so we did that half of her hair with really the Dyson. Because that's like what my hair is like looking like before. And then now it's like way more flat and nice. Also though guys, I do put I do put in product that helps my hair not be frizzy. So that's probably also why it's really flat. Did you not put it in? I did. Put oh it you in. did. Okay, good. Oh okay, yeah, this one came with a glove. glove. Should we try the glove? I don't know why you would need the glove. It's like maybe for the crown. Maybe it does get hot. Got the glove. Okay. longer to dry yeah. than the Dyson side. I'd say I like the brush better on this one than I do on this one. I feel like my hair got caught more on the Dyson. True. Side. But this one I feel like went through. And I feel like this one, the bristles are a little bit easier, easier to, to brush, brush through, through compared to like this one. And I feel like we got about the same result on these sides. Yeah. So a little bit longer on this one, but a better brush. A better brush. This one is a little bit stronger and faster, but a little bit harder of bristles yes. that aren't necessarily the best for your hair. I'm gonna have her curl her own hair because she knows how she likes it. But I'm just curious. So these things, basically they send air in there and then it wraps your hair around it automatically. I like that this one has arrows and tells you which way it's which going way to but we'll see the difference. Okay, okay. I'm gonna do that one. And it doesn't have the little shock thing on there, does yeah, it? To shock it with coal. Okay, what are your thoughts on it? It's not very strong, so it doesn't really like, like, um, what's it called? Big pieces. So it did take like, oh, it's, I don't know. It's, mm, she said it was a little annoying was a little to annoying use. Because I couldn't like, it wouldn't. But rock. the curl turned out the pretty. Curl, yeah, the curl turned out pretty good. It's actually how I like curl my hair usually. So, it's not bad. But let's do the other side. Okay, now it's time for the Dyson one. Okay, so that side is the with the dupe. With the dupe. I mean, I have like a lot of like volume and it did like curl it nice. Yeah, the curl's pretty. Curl's pretty. Okay. See, this one's like really strong. It's just like, comes at you. <laughs> <laughs> So this has a little thing right here that you can shock it to cold versus yeah. hot, and the curls should hopefully stay better. I do like how I can do bigger, bigger sections, and it actually like wraps like my whole hair. If I go down a little bit.
Okay, what's your opinion? So halfway in between, I was like, I kind of like how this side curled my hair better. Really? Yes. Did you like that? How Only curled? because this curl, I feel like curls the, like a little bit of the bottoms. And I'm not a fan of curling the ends of my hair. And it kind of just wraps it all. And I guess I was annoyed because this wasn't wrapping my hair at all. But then it curled it how I wanted it to be curled. So, I mean, I still like both sides, but I kind of feel like the side's already falling out a little bit. I know, it is, versus that side versus is still holding. the side is still holding pretty well. So, wow, so she actually liked the dupe better yeah, than the Dyson. It was, I don't think I would like use it on like regular basis because it's kind of annoying, but I do like how it curled my hair better. So she is gonna wear her hair like this all day. We're gonna see which one holds, and then at the end of the day, or the end of this vlog, so stay tuned. Yes. Um, she will tell you which one she feels like is worth it and not. I feel like if you were just trying to dry your hair, I think the Dyson was a little bit stronger yes. and maybe faster if you're in a hurry. But the other one also did the same job, just like a little bit longer. Mm -hmm. But, interesting. I'm gonna say, that side is done with the Dyson, oh. and then that side is done with the dupe. No, no. Right. This side was done with the dupe, and this side was done with the Dyson. I, I actually like that side better. You like this side, but that's what I said too. Yeah. So she likes the dupe better. Interesting. <laughs> this one has a quick backstory on the last thing we're going to review, which are the Christian Dior necklaces. <laughs> okay, really quick. So every year for Christmas, I'm like, okay, I get the kids like one like bigger gift and then a bunch of little gifts. And so most of the kids are like switches and a new, you know, pair of Jordans or shoes or whatever, all that kind of stuff. This year, Hannah was like, I want the Christian Dior necklace was like her bigger gift. Yes. Um, and I looked it up and I was like, they're like $700. So I actually wanted this for my birthday and then I also put it on my Christmas this last year and Arian and I did this thing where if we don't get it one year for Christmas, then we'll keep putting it on our list and hopefully we'll get it. They do. And then I got it this Hello. year. That's kind of black. Okay. And then I ended up getting it. So, <laughs> so excited. But okay, here's the backstory on it though. So I was looking because sometimes I'm like, there's different sites that you can go to. There's Etsy has one. Um, the Real Real is there's an app called The Real Real, which is like people reselling their name brand things yeah. and different things. So you can get really, really great prices sometimes on things. And so I was out there searching for a great price and I found one on Etsy and it was $137. And I was like, yeah. And they had a little story on there that was like, yeah, this is genuine, like it's real. Basically, they their boyfriend broke up with them, they wanted to sell it, they needed the money, blah, blah, blah. So I was like, cool, like I just got a steal for this necklace. I ordered this in like the end of October, I think beginning of November, and it never came in. And I was like, I think I got scammed. And I tried writing back and they wouldn't respond. And I was like, I totally got scammed. And so as Christmas was coming, I ended up getting her the actual necklace uh, because I didn't want to get scammed out of money again. And then like a month later, like it was January something, it finally came in the mail. And I was like, okay, three or four months later. Uh, but it wasn't real either. It was a dupe, it was fake. Um, but, so I was curious if Hannah could tell the difference between a real and a fake one. Like, is it really worth it? And here's the footage to see if she could tell the difference. As you can tell, I'm in Hannah's room. And it's time to see if she can really tell the difference between a Christian Dior necklace and a knockoff Christian Dior necklace. So we're about to find out. She doesn't know I'm in here right now, but okay. So here's the thing. It's actually a really long story of why I have both, but I will tell you, here's her box. Okay, let's open it. Okay, so here is the real Christian Dior necklace. And here is a fake. So it is a little bit more gold. And you can tell this one's a little more chunky. But they're pretty close. 
So, let's see if she can talk. Oh, Hannah! Where are you? Okay, I have a challenge for you. Hi. You ready for this? Let's see it. Can you tell the difference between a real Christian Dior necklace and a knockoff? Okay. Let's. Where? In your room on your bed. In my room. Yep. So one of these is the real one, and one is a fake. Hi. Hi. Mom, if she guesses the right one, does she get to keep it? <laughs> she already got it this for Christmas. Which one? Are you sure about that? Yeah, I'm 100% sure. Wait. Yeah, it's this one's fake. Ding, 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 ding. I can tell because you got the, it right. Of the thing. How can you tell? These ones are thicker. Look. And I know because I put this on and it was more like thick. <laughs> she got it. I'm impressed. And the really colors impressed. are a little different. This one's more like yellow. bright yellow. This one's more this gold. More, yeah. Like yeah. it's more of like a bronzy. Yeah. Not so bright. Wow. She can tell the difference. That's impressive. Good. Good. <laughs> She's like, put it back in. Back, back, back. <laughs> Don't give me the fake one. So she was able to tell the difference. I personally don't like spending a lot of money on jewelry, just my personal opinion. Um, I The necklace I wear all the time is $14 on Amazon. I will link it down below because I love the necklace. And I just feel like replacing it as soon as like discolors or turns is what I do. But if you wanted something long-term to last forever, I mean, obviously it's the higher brand. So I'm curious though, could we have switched? We don't know which one's which. Can Aaron tell the difference between a real and a fake? He's holding the camera right now. <laughs> so this one or this one? Which one's real, which one's fake? I'm gonna say that one's the real. You think the one I have on is the real? Yeah. That is the fake! <laughs> you cannot tell the difference wow. between real and fake. I'm impressed. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna ask Grandma and Bonnie if they can tell the difference, and then we are gonna take this to either Walmart, Target. We'll take it around. One vote for the fake, zero votes for real. So is this really worth it? We'll see. Aunt Bonnie, we have a question for you. Yes. One of us has a real necklace on and one of us has a fake. Which one do you think is which? Can I feel them? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, what are we doing? She's seeing if it's magnetic. <laughs> That's actually really <laughs> smart. <laughs> well, because if it's real, then it won't um, magnetic to it. Okay. <laughs> okay, I feel this one is. Oh, you got it you got right. It. You got it right. I do. Yeah, you did. Good job. I think a lot of cool. people think this one's the fake one. I think she she got this one right, but I think a lot of people think this one's the fake one because it is so like Good. big and like chunky. Yeah. And some like jewelry that's like sometimes like fake won't like be like that. So that's true. So, that's true. I think that's why a lot of people. Yeah. This is a very, very important question. You're going to be a tiebreaker. Okay. okay. And Hannah and I have switched it up. You have no idea. Who is wearing a real Christian Dior necklace? Look at Aaron sauteing in the background. Wait, I missed it. No, I wanted to see your saute. That's I'm worth it. Gordon Ramsay, who? <laughs> I can't really see yours. Okay, wait. I'll you show can, you. Okay. You can touch it too. So, real, one's real, one's fake. This is his. Okay. You can touch him. No, don't yank it! If it breaks, then you would know. Then you would know. Oh, the lighting's not good. It's really good okay, which one? Uh, I'm gonna guess Hannah. Hannah's is what? Real or yep. fake? That one's real? Yeah. Yep, it is! How could you tell? Gold Testa. <laughs> gold tested. Well, it's not actual gold, it's gold plated. So no, they're gold plated. If you get the pure gold 
of that goes to is their life. Oh, Six to seven thousand dollars. It's crazy. But okay, that's two for real, one for fake. So how could you really tell the difference? So it's not the look, it's just like Hannah wouldn't wear something fake. Like I couldn't see Hannah wearing anything what? that's like <laughs> fake. So you and based so it I on- I know your conversation you guys had, you're like, which one should I wear? And Hannah's like, I call the real one. Like there's no way Hannah- What? That's not the conversation we had. It's mine. I don't know. I, but that was my first thought. Is that okay, so if it wasn't on us and it was sitting there, would you have been able to tell? No. No? no, you couldn't. Well. That's what we should have done. We should have put it down like how We you should have put it, it down, <laughs> right? So when you were doing it for me, I, I had tried it on before, so I knew how heavy it was. Oh, uh, that's how you can tell. And trying it on, and I was like, oh. I feel like we give a half a point each because you did it based on us, not on the necklaces. <laughs> we're one and a half to one and a half. <laughs> the golds are different, too. Yeah, so this one's a little more yellow, or... This is like more yellow. Yellower, yeah, the fake one. <laughs> Max said you can't tell in the weight. Like, they kind of feel similar. They feel very similar. Yeah, actually. It's interesting. So we are going to ask our two editors, which is... So Lucas has been editing for us. <laughs> All right, Lucas, come here real quick. We have a very important question. A smoothie. Don't tell him if he's right or not, because then we have to ask Mark. Which one of us is wearing a real Dior necklace and which one's wearing a fake? <laughs> get roasted in the comments. Uh, that one's real. This one's real? Okay, Mark, which one do you want? Oh, okay. <laughs> Say the other one. Can I touch you? You can touch him, yeah. Okay. For oh crap, I should have done that. They they weigh they about actually the weigh same. Pretty similar. Oh, okay. I actually edited the footage for this, so I know it's this one. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Mark, Wait. Yeah, did it. You got it wrong. You got it wrong. One and one. Wait, why did you say that, Lucas? I don't know. It's more shiny. Okay. Yes, I don't know. You we were mean, saying that because she I'm not like doesn't jewel work. Wait, was it, which one did you say hers was? Oh, this was the real one. And I remember it because Hannah said it's thicker in the video. Oh, that's, would you have been able to tell had you not edited that footage? Um, I would have probably still got that one because it's like a deeper gold. It looks more fancy. And this one looks more like shiny. Interesting. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, so now it's, are we counting the half as max because it was half and half? Yeah. Or are we doing one and one? Or one? Uh. Where did you get okay. that one? Okay, so basically we're at... Two and a half to two and a half, right? Yes. Points. So, so far it's pretty even. It's mixed. Yes. Who knows? Okay, so we found someone in Target. Can you tell the difference between our necklaces? Like, which one is real and which one's fake? I would say this one is fake and this one is fake. Wow, actually this, this is the real one. Wow. This is it. wow. <laughs> they're they're really pretty. Oh, thank they're you. Both great. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Alright, we found one more person to ask. Can you tell which necklace is real and which one is fake? Can I get a closer look? Yeah. yeah. You can even touch can it. Even touch it. <laughs> and this isn't a trick question. No, it's not no, a trick really question. Yeah. One is real and one is fake. This one's real. Yeah, you're right. Good job. Good job. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Okay, so we're tied again. It's three and a half to three and a half. I feel like I don't know. I feel like it's we're trying not even. to Ariana run, to run into something. Okay, I feel like it's just even. Yeah. Like I don't know. So we're gonna head over to Walmart and yes. see if they can be a tiebreaker. Or if we can find a couple more people to break this tie. Okay, we are at Walmart <laughs> and we found another person. And can you tell the difference between which one is real and which one is fake? You can, you like, can touch you it. can touch yeah, them. You can touch mm. it. Okay. <laughs> I can't tell, really, to tell you the truth. Just give it your best I guess. I can't either, <laughs> just so you know. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. I'm guessing this one's real. You're right! Oh, am I right? You're yeah. right! I really couldn't tell though. I'm just in the You're so oh, we're getting it right! Thank you! You're welcome! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you. <laughs>
<laughs> okay, two last people really quick. Okay, real fast. Who is wearing the real necklace and who is wearing a fake? And don't think about it based on our personalities because we might have switched, we might have not, we don't know. You can this touch, one's real, that one's fake. Okay, Allie. So Alex says I'm this real, one's I'm real, fake. this one's fake. Come on, just take a guess. I want to know. <laughs> there's, there's like such a big difference. I'm gonna go with that one's real. This one's real? Yeah. Ah, yes, I knew it. No, this one's fake. It. Oh. <laughs> That one won. The fake one. So is the real worth it or the fake? <laughs> Definitely not worth it. <laughs> That's not the, based on the boat. Based on the boat. Based on the boat. I thought because it's sh it's more gold. This it is one's more, gold. more. And that one's a little more chunky. Darker. And this one feels yeah. heavier. Yeah, but more expensive gold is darker. Oh wait, no, this one. <laughs> well, I didn't know heavier. that. I thought this one looks nicer. Kind of the same weight. I thought this one looks nicer, but I was. I, don't know. I just thought the shine was different. <laughs> than, um, I took a guesstimate. Okay, one more quick question. We're trying to figure out what's worth it or not. Okay, it is almost the end of the day, but her hair, half of it was curled with the Dyson, and half of it was curled with the dupe. Which side do you like better? Do you like this side better? You like that side better? This has more curl to it. This side. Brody would say this side. <laughs> I'm gonna push it down. See, I liked this side better too, and it was the dupe. Oh. Really? Yeah. yeah! And this one was the Dyson. Wow. This one, I feel like, didn't stay, like, hold as well. Yeah. Like, up here. And this one curled, like, how I like it. Yeah. <laughs> so I have to say the dupes won today. Yeah. <laughs> like, so maybe the more expensive, like, stuff. Maybe it's not worth it. I don't know. It was interesting to see the different things and how the curls even held and what people thought. I don't know, when they looked at our necklaces, the dog almost just took me out. Uh, I think sometimes it's just think, the brand yeah. name. Yeah. That makes you think it's hard for Max. So Max was throwing a ball in the background and hit this one. I thought he completely shattered it. I thought he was going to break, like, completely break it too. I shattered it. Yeah. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah. Wow, that's a strong last. I guess those lights are worth it. We're gonna see what lights are worth it and what lights are worth it. Maybe you should install those all around the house. <laughs> Knowing it just took a ball. It's, Max always was our ball in the giant closet. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you got past that. Too. <laughs> I don't know. It won't screw back yet. Oh. Maybe you did break it. Good job, Max. Wow, Max. Up fine. Buy her a new one. <laughs> Buy her a new one. Okay, I got it. It's not broken. The light lives another day. Dude, I'm so surprised <laughs> that did not shatter. I'm surprised it didn't break. It's all crooked. Yeah, it's crooked. Even the camera, it's though, you're not up that high. No, he wasn't up that when high. When you were filming? No. It definitely just... Oh, oh yeah, no. Perfect. You could hear it, but I so didn't get it. So basically a ball went flying and hit that glass so behind us. You know, we did the best we can. We'll fix it. Okay. <laughs> Max is banned from any ball in my house. So what Hallie was saying is sometimes you pay for the name brand, even though they're very similar or that kind of thing. Fake jewelry can turn your skin green. So that's that's one thing to consider. Interesting. Maybe you, maybe you should check your neck at the end of the day. I try. <laughs> that should be if it's worth it or not. Is my neck green? <laughs> I don't think on this one. You would, it would only over. really get green, green, what? Green if it was like wet and then you left it. Like if you took a yeah. shower with it on or like that kind of thing. Very nice. Now see, Maddie's on the table. <laughs> good job, mom. Good job, mom. <laughs> Setting a good example. Why are you, I've never seen you on the table. I've never seen Maddie go on the table. Her, her ball was on the table. Oh, her ball was on the table. The dupe ones are in the description if you guys want to go get those. And yeah. Well, just the curler. Just not the curler. This was not that. Might have been a scam, but I got it. So we don't know. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll see you guys next time. Bye. 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 Remember, wait, remember you are worth it. Bye. <laughs>